to the Factor Uncensored. It's Friday, and if you ain't got no job and nothing to do, we have something special for you. Pops, a.k.a. actor, comedian John Witherspoon, is here with us on the Factor today. Thank you for coming on oh, the Factor Uncensored. Oh, my Censor. pleasure. It is my pleasure to meet you. <laughs> A comedy, comedic legend right here oh, on the Factor Uncensored. That Censor. sounds so good. <laughs> <laughs> so what brings you to Houston? Well, I'm working at the Improv Saturday and Sunday, two shows a Saturday. And one show Sunday, then I'm back to L.A. What um, can the people expect from you when they come out here well, in Houston to see you? Well, you know, I've been here many uh, times, and they know my act. You know, I'm, I talk about uh, myself, uh, getting old. I talk about my kids and going to Costco's. <laughs> it's just it's shopping at Costco's. It's just having a lot of fun. <laughs> Costco's uh, is quite an adventure. Oh, my God. <laughs> Special on Saturday mornings yeah. when you get the free food samples. And they're always trying to give you something free. And you don't want nothing free. I just want to get by you. Please, just let me get down the aisle. <laughs> eat this. Please eat this. I want to keep my job. <laughs> now, is that where you focus now on your comedy, everyday life, things that you experience that you and I and other people can relate to? Oh, yeah. That and, and also, you know, I have bits. I, I sing. I do satchmo. Um, and I talk about people that we lost last year. Like Ali and uh, Prince and all that. I talk about I do all that. Mm -hmm. That uh, I cover a whole gambit of. For uh, you can see me dancing there. See? <laughs> <laughs> that shirt looked pretty good there. Oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you got to coordinate. <laughs> coordinate exactly. <laughs> bang bang bang. Bang bang bang. <laughs> now, when people come out and they see you yeah. in person, are they ever? I guess. Uh, Surprise of the longevity of your career, and are you surprised at the longevity of your career, and how long have you continued from movies to TV um, to the stage? Well, you know, I learned all this when I went to the Comedy Store uh, at, in L.A., mm -hmm. Hollywood, because you know you, you you go start out as a comic or or an actor, but there's so much other parts you can do. You can act in, in commercials. You can act in this, and I, I do voiceover. Mm -hmm. So at the comedy store, they come there looking for comics who can do voiceovers, who can do, do commercial. So I got a lot of stuff from the comedy store. And people are surprised that I'm still in the business. <laughs> Boom, you, you should give it up. Besides Friday, what are you most recognized for when people come up to um, you? What character do they recite to you that they love so much? They love the characters from Boomerang. Mm -hmm. You got you to gotta coordinate. <laughs> bang, 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 bang. Yeah. yeah, they love the character from Boomerang, yeah. How did you create so many memorable characters that have endured and, and, and survived the test of time? Well, what I did was you, they give me the script, and in some places, some movies, some TV shows, want you to stick with the script. So I said, I'm gonna stick with the script. Okay, I'm gonna stick with the script. To the camera, to this and action. Now I do my own stuff. Mm -hmm. They laugh at it so hard. And they say, we gotta keep it in. Keep it in. Yeah, but I, I forced them to, to uh, listen to me. They said, no, Mr. Witherspoon, you cannot do that. We want you to stick to the script. Okay, I'm not gonna mess with you. Action. I do what I want to do. <laughs> a lot of people are wondering also, you know, through your talents, will you use them again on another Friday? Have you heard anything yes. about another Friday? I talked to Ice Cube. We said we're supposed to do another Friday. How soon? Oh, I, I don't know. I don't think they started yet because I, I, <laughs> I haven't received any money. <laughs> I know. But we, he said Warner Brothers, they haven't written that check. See, that's the problem. Mm -hmm. When they write that check, we're going to all be happy. You'll be ready to roll. Oh, rock and roll. Once again, let's go over the dates for you here at the yes. Improv on Saturday and Sunday. And Sunday. Uh, 7 p.m. and 9.30 p.m. Yeah. on Saturday and Sunday, 7.30 p.m. And if yep. you want tickets, ImprovHouston.com. Mr. Witherspoon, what can they expect? Are you excited to see Houstonians again? Well, they're always so good. They so We're excited to see each other. Uh -huh. And then I have a chance to work with a guy I grew up at the comedy store with, Andy Huggins. Mm -hmm. He's going to be the feature. He's, we started the comedy store together 30 years, 35 years ago. Got that history. Oh, man, Andy, he's funny, too. Absolutely. So we, we, have, we, have, we have a good time. Can I mention my cooking show? Yeah, sure. I have a cooking show on YouTube. It's called John Witherspoon Cooking for Poor People. <laughs> because when you're hungry. Sounds like my kind of channel. Because when you're hungry, everything tastes good. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Best crock I ever had. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Witherspoon. Thanks for having for me. Coming on the Factor on